Welcome to this quick demonstration of adding text fields to iPad Formmaker by Isoperla. We're in design mode and we'll just uh, drag in a couple of text fields. Um, these are text boxes and each text box just has a label and a text area and we can go in and on the settings panel we can just change the label. We can also change the length of the uh, the caption in relation to the, the text area and there I've made the caption long for no good reason really. Um, here I'll put in an email and I'll, I'll make that long as well and I'll change the the keyboard type to email. Okay and I'll change the number of columns here on this um, on this section to two columns and uh, that's just to make it look a little bit nicer with these with these fields and I'll drag in a notepad field now this is a, a long text field so you can have text just about as long as you like with this uh, it's a standard iOS control and um, let's just drag in the, the final type of input for text which is a, a free freehand text. Now this is quite often used to capture a signature but it can be used to capture any type of freehand text uh, such as your own notes uh, if you like to. Now with these fields um, what we can do is we can move them around using the up and down uh, buttons on the uh, on the settings panel uh, or we can drag them around using a two finger drag. Now remember this is a two finger drag moving controls around as opposed to the one finger drag when you're dragging in new controls from the uh, from the left hand uh, side. The line break puts us an extra an extra space, an extra control space between the previous control and this control. And we can also clone um, controls as well like that. Now that's because I put in a line break on that freehand control it's cloned the line break as well which is kind of like not what we want. So I'll just remove that extra line break. And um, the final thing we can do really on the on the settings panel is to delete uh, controls. And, uh, and there we go, we delete that one and let's delete the other notes as well. There we go. Let's confirm that. And uh, that's all about all there is to it. Um, we save that using the tick there and we can run that and start capturing details.